morning. Why do I look... Is that... Am I tanning? What the... Guess I'm tanning. Wow. Okay. Doesn't help with the glasses. Burn. Okay. Here we go. So I am out in the middle of the boomies. I'm out here in the middle of nowhere. It's fantastic. But... I don't like the spot. There must be something special about the spot though because yesterday I had at least two or three people show up, come through here. Look very disappointed that I was here, of course, and then turn around. Aside from that though, I think I'm gonna go to the Foggy Bottom restaurant. It has free Wi-Fi and the only other place here that has free Wi-Fi that I know of is a coffee shop. But the coffee shop is kind of pricey. They don't give away free refills or even paid refills. So last time I went there, I ended up spending $6 on a cup of coffee because I bought a coffee twice and that was $3 on $3. It's very expensive for coffee. So I tell people, Starbucks is not that expensive. I'll go in there and spend like $2.30 and get unlimited refills for free. Anyway, I gotta wake up. Jeep told me that before I do hikes in the morning, or whenever I end up doing them, he said that I should do uh, push-ups. Get the upper, you know, blood moving in the upper parts. That way when I go on my hike and my legs are moving, it gets the whole body cycling. Because that's how he explained it to me. It's not a bad idea. I'm gonna drop and do however many I feel like doing. One, two, three, four, five. 17, 18, 19, 20, whoo. All right, let's stretch. One, two, three, four, five, six, 15. Uh, okay, so 15, still not a bad start. Baby steps. either of these paths lead to but yesterday it was on and off it would rain and then it would stop and I told myself tomorrow in the morning first thing we'll go take a walk on these paths you know originally I was planning on walking down here to see if I could get the Jeep down here and uh, so far as I can see I can but I really don't know what's at the bottom so I don't really feel like driving the Jeep all the way down here just to turn around and come back but I need a hike it's a nice place to walk around, nice trees. This one's got flowers on it. So yeah, just kinda taking this hike, soaking it all in. Although it looks like it's gonna rain again soon. I'm walking down this trail, shouldn't be an issue, but it's all uphill. So when I turn around to go back, that's when I'm really gonna get that calf burn. It's just more workout routine. That was my plan. I knew as soon as I got out into the forest, I'm gonna go on these hikes, these like beautiful hikes, and whoop, I'm gonna just naturally get back in shape. Jeep said that the key to weight loss is to burn more calories than you eat. So, as long as I'm burning more calories than I'm eating, I should be okay. Oh no, and I hear rain. I hope it doesn't rain, I didn't bring any rain gear. I don't feel like protecting my camera the whole way back. The view out here is incredible. I love the green, but I can hear the rain coming. So I'm gonna walk to the bottom here, where I think it actually, I think that's where it ends. And I'm gonna turn around and I don't think I'm gonna get to see what's on the second trail because it's raining. Got a place for a fire there. <laughs> Spare firewood here, especially if you brought a chainsaw. Nice look out of the water. And funny thing is, if you look right over there, Right off into the distance, that mountain right there, that's where we camped for the meetup. So 
La Bonita Hambari happened right over there. This is actually where we're looking off to. I really want to buy a kayak and I wanted to do an epic boat adventure. I was going to get in my kayak and I was going to ride from that location over there and there's an island just right over here. Can't see it from here because it's right over this place I'm on right now. It's just a small little island but you know it's not like a beach or anything but I wanted to get a boat, pack some things in a backpack, sail over here and spend the night on the island. It's still kind of up in the air but I think I need to save my funds for more important things. Now that I got everything out here going pretty good for me, I am going to head to... I'm going to go to the Foggy Bottom restaurant because they have free Wi-Fi and hopefully that the breakfast isn't open because I want coffee but... Why is it not starting? Okay, it took a second, but she started. It smells like something's burning. I don't know. Might have been the moisture too. On these old Jeeps, you know, the littlest thing causes problems. But she didn't start like there was anything wrong with her, just like there was problems starting her, so. Who knows? As long as she starts in the, in the end of the day.
So far from heaven you have come My windows are never clean, not like super clean. And from a distance, it looked like there was no window here. It was so clean. I mean, it's not perfect, but I was like, did someone bust my window? I was like really scared for a second, but it's okay. It's my stuff is still there and the window's still intact. It was just, scared me for a second. Beaver's Bend. What are you doing? Look, look at this. Look at the, look at the view. Which means the sun would come up over here. This isn't a coffee bar. And there's wife. Someone make this a coffee bar, please. On behalf of me. Do I have to do this? I can be the one. I volunteer this tribute. Make this a coffee bar. Come on, guys. Guys, look at this. Welcome to Beaver's Bend Hiking Trail. Donations are accepted. They want donations. I'm a, you know, I was going to put money in here just out of obligation, but they asked for donations. Seriously, they get paid. I, they get paid, you know. Mo most people have to earn jobs, you know. Most people, they work hard. They work nine to five hour shifts. In fact, these people, they shouldn't. Oh, wow, dear, dude. Hi, dear. Hello. Hi. Okay, well, like I was saying, like, how dare they? How dare they ask for my money? My hard-earned money? They shouldn't even be asking for money, guys. This is ridiculous. You know, I bet they're young, immature, and childish for asking for money. They don't need money out here. They should be, they should just do all this stuff for free, you know? And then go get a 9-to-5 job. They should just be working, working like I am. These millennials nowadays, they think everything. They think they need money for everything. They don't even they don't even try to work for themselves. Just stupendous. Ridiculous. How dare they.